efforts to help out the uh, XDP patients as you yourself actually has successfully done took over uh, the problem. So uh, we felt that we would like to you know, get together and give tribute to you. Uh, you have shown the world how uh, an XDP patient can actually survive and you know, do something great. Riding the bike from Manila. <laughs> okay. we, we actually met before uh, on the airplane, I can recall. And uh, at that time, you did not have manifestations, I think. And you told us here. Yes. And it was new. So uh, the health central staff and the sunshine staff are here. Can you please give a round of applause to the uh, uh,
I am a new found brother today. I just met him today and I really feel close to with him. So I think I have a new found brother and thank you for that. And we both are Estonia patients, we both have implants, but we're different. He's, I think his daughter is not that artistic because he's, he said the he said the person is just like my mind is yes. And this and this battery was inserted. So you thought your daughter was not really that artistic. I'm sorry to say. Thank you very much, Don't no, thank you very much. Thank you very much to all of you. So in closing, uh, I just want to say that uh, Dr. George Peter would have been very happy to see all of us here. He was one of the pioneer doctors who looked into XTP and uh, developed awareness uh, next to Dr. Lee and Lee. So uh, that's why we have a George Viterbo Movement Disorder Clinic here. And uh, we would like to congratulate everyone and thank everyone. And uh, we promise to continue with the Sanctuary Care Foundation to give care to the STD patients. So uh, you're always welcome here. Thank you. Thank you.